My New Year's? Oh, well. It's been three days and I'm still drunk. <laughs> I forgot what it's like to be sober, but it, you know, it's not that memorable if I can't fucking remember. Do you want to know something? I'm 32 years old, and I'm still a virgin. It's because I got a... <coughs> it's because I got a tiny penis, and I'm too embarrassed to show it to anybody. Well, at least when I'm sober. God, I, could, I don't think I'll ever lose my virginity. You can't have sex when you're drunk, and you can't have sex when you're sober when you got a puny little dick like mine. <laughs> Plus, I got enough vices to make any junkie out the street feel good about himself. Of course, I was never one to judge anybody for having fun, so don't get me wrong there. I wasn't so un... I wasn't... I wasn't so unambitious. I used to raise chickens, you know. I used to live on a farm, yeah. Uh-huh. But... You know, all good things come to an end. Oh, I used to, oh God, I had a uh, Old English Game, Bard Rocks, Rhode Island Reds, I had Speckled Sussex, I had Black Tailed, White Japanese, Bantams, all Bantams, the tiny kind, not the big kind. You didn't eat these kind, no. These were more for like show or, you know, like 4-H projects, things like that. But, you know, in that neighborhood, like, well, we kind of lived in the boonies. So, like, they started stretching out the suburbs a little farther and farther and farther. So pretty, pretty, pretty soon they started building condos around the farm that I grew up on. They had condos, shopping malls. So all the wild beasts of the desert would just went, you know, mad, you know. <laughs> they would start looking for food in people's garbages. They would eat my chickens you know, the work, so, you know, man drove them out, and they drove me out, drove me straight out of business, they ate all my chickens, I had, I had a fucking graveyard in the, my backyard, I did, well, the chickens that they didn't eat would just, they'd get so scared, they'd have heart attacks, it was pretty, I loved those chickens, like babies, I did, I did, I loved them, they were great, they're great, they're great pets, I mean, People don't give them enough credit, you know. Oh, if I could have babies, I'd be having sex left and right. I'd have about ten of them. I'd live in, like, the cheapest place I could live, like a fucking trailer or some shit like that. And be like, get me a Diet Pepsi! Every damn ten of them. Go down to the laundromat and get me a Diet Pepsi! <laughs> I think it'd be a lot more satisfying to, like, have children instead of just sex all the time, you know? Well, I've never had sex. I mean, I've had sex with myself. <laughs> but that does that count? I mean, I don't know. I still think that I'm a virgin, even though I masturbate, like, 10,000 times a day. <laughs> you know what really pisses me off, though? It re what really pisses me off is that people think that chickens are dumb. But they're not. You know what chickens are? Honest to goodness, this is what chickens are. They're fucking indifferent. And there's a big motherfucking difference between not giving a shit about something and being dumb, you know? You know what I'm saying? Anyway, the day that fucking chickens are gonna start to care, all those black tail hawks, all those coyotes, and all even modern men are gonna get exactly what's coming to them. You'll see. You heard me. People think I'm crazy. I'm just kidding. <laughs>